There's a time in every young man's life when he will feel the unshakable desire to go out and buy a submarine sandwich and eat it bite by bite. In this video, see the gripping footage of me and my truck that I bought here recently after moving to North Carolina, Wilmington. And I drove around the corner and down the street and bought one of these sandwiches. And then I took it back to my house and I did just that. I ate it. I like having a car now that I've moved to North Carolina, but the main thing it allows me to do is go out farther and get more different food instead of having it delivered to my house. That's the main difference. You're listening to Hardly Anything Considered on PDPR. Peter Draw's private radio is made possible in part by attentive and painfully attractive listeners like yourselves. I do find that it's easier, or it's easier to keep drawing if I'm hungry, if I get hungry during the process, than to start drawing if I'm hungry. If, I, if I'm just sitting there hungry and I haven't started drawing yet, the only thing I can think about is drawing. I mean hunger. I mean eating. But if I get hungry while I'm drawing, I can usually power through until I'm done. But drawing is the important part. And eating is just something I get out of the way so I can get to the lines. In other local news, it took me quite a few days after moving here to shave my face for the first time because I couldn't find my razor and I wasn't sure if I had lost it in the move or if I just couldn't find it at one of the at the bottom of one of the boxes I just hadn't unpacked all the way um, I should have just went and bought a new one obviously so I could shave my face um, but you know it's just like one of those things maybe I'll find it in five minutes or tomorrow and I just couldn't pull the trigger on it but eventually I did go buy a new razor and I had been using the same one my parents gave me when I turned 16 or 18 or something and I was surprised to find out how expensive they were also I went to the grocery store and bought some supplies for making sandwiches like I am prone to do however after only one or two days of making sandwiches, I fell into the common trap of being a little peckish one night and just holding the packet of sliced cheese in my hand and eating the whole thing over the course of about 15 minutes or so. It was absolutely delicious, but now uh, I couldn't make any more sandwiches without cheese, of course, and so then my other ingredients went unused, so I had to eat the slices of lunch meat by themselves as well. And so I ended up eating most of the sandwich stuff piecemeal, as it were, instead of in sandwich form. Um, and that's all for local news. Let's see what else there is. 
It looks like some reports from local experts show that I do still enjoy drawing, which bodes well for the economy here in this household. Um, this drawing in particular took a lot of, um, you know, it looked, took a lot of stippling, uh, which took a lot of time. Um, it was fun though. Um, I just used some uh, basic shapes and stuff and threw them together. Um, anything look cool if you can, you know, combine a few shapes and then, you know, you make it, you give it a little bit of depth with a few different shades of, uh, you know, I don't know, it's hard to explain. You just gotta play around with it a bunch is what I'm trying to say. Um, if you're like, Peter, how do I draw something cool? I don't know. Draw something a lot of times and eventually you'll experiment your way into something interesting. It's not going to happen the first first or the tenth or hundredth time you draw probably. Um, maybe the hundredth time. Maybe the tenth time. Who knows? It's all a process and uh, yeah. I mean we didn't land on the moon the first time we I mean I guess the first time we landed on the moon we stepped on it but the moon is a bad example. Um, but keep drawing if that's what you like to do. That's what I do. Um, like other things that I don't like to do, like um, like ice skating and crocheting, I don't keep doing those things. But on the other hand, I do enjoy drawing, so I keep doing that. Um, anyways, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. This has been PDPR, Peter Draws Private Radio, signing out.